Hey guys, Abs here. In this short video, I'm going to be showing you exactly how you can make sure that you get the best out of the keyword genetic software. In particular, I'm going to be discussing the LSI Discovery tab. The LSI Discovery tab requires a little bit more understanding than the SERP Analysis tab to actually work with and to make sure we're getting the right semantically related themed keywords from Google that we're actually hoping for. Now, just before I get onto the LSI Discovery tab, guys, I want to make notes that we actually had our first update to the keyword genetic software. Okay, so coming back over to the LSI Discovery tab. Oops, one more thing as well, guys. When we do release an update, then inside of your keyword genetics folder, you'll actually have a text file called Release Notes. And if you have a look on there, guys, it says here the 13th of April 2014, we released an update, the release ver update version 1.001, and it was to do with a progress bar issue that we fixed. And I think there was a handful of computers. Well, there's actually one user um, that had the software crash on them, and we managed to now it down to it being the progress bar anyway the issue has been resolved so let's get over to the LSI discovery tab and let me show you exactly how we can make sure we get the correct semantically related themed keywords okay so um, we actually had an email from one user and they typed in wedding planner and they clicked on start to get LSI keywords and they weren't happy with the results so I'm going to be showing the results now and I'm going to be showing you exactly why they got these results and how we can turn these results around okay so this has been done here so as you can see for wedding planner we got things like parents kids pets um, wedding planner um, I don't know you've got things in all different languages as well so half of them I don't even feel safe reading out okay so what I'm gonna do now is um, I'm gonna try and explain this so um, the best way to exp the best way to explain this is um, going back over to my sales page on the sales page I made a note that words can be grouped and thematically grouped with other sets so I gave you an example of chocolate whereby chocolate can be grouped with chocolate itself so obviously you've got chocolate white chocolate red uh, milk chocolate chocolate bars and then you've also got colors you've got chocolate cream white pink blue you've got chocolate it's edible it's a thing that you can eat you've got chocolate food I don't know um, apples whatever other edible items as well so what we need to understand here is obviously chocolate was a very easy and it was a very easy word for me to explain when it comes to wedding planner and when it comes to other words that we're going to be looking for then it's going to be very hard and very difficult for us to actually find out exactly what how many types of themes and sets Google actually relates that word with so what we need to do is we need to make sure and try our best to enter words in combination by entering words in combination you're actually getting much more precise so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna keep wedding planner in here and underneath it I'm gonna type in bride okay so bride and wedding as we know go very closely together and there's not going to be many sets that Google can um, theme up both of them words with other than everything related to bride grooms weddings okay so let this finish and we'll have a look at the results <clears throat> okay so let's have a look at the results now We've got new baby, we've got anniversary, we've got wedding ceremony, uh, we've got hen party, obviously we've got a birthday in there, uh, we've got wedding reception, wedding engagement, bride, wedding planning, groom, wedding planning and honeymoon. So we're getting much more narrower, we're getting much more specific and we, we are getting the results that we want, but we were only able to get these results guys after we understood how the LSI discovery script works. So this is why it's very important that we try our best to understand that in order to get the right kind of the, uh, to get the right kind of um, LSI words that we're looking for, then it's very important that we try and give Google or force that set out of Google by giving them combinations. Sometimes you can give them more. So I'll go in here and I'll type in groom. So I'll, I'll give them three. Now I'm not sure if this is going to give us a better or more precise LSI keywords, um, but it's certainly making sure that we're sticking exactly to the theme that we want. I'm going to give you some more examples in a moment as well. Now let this complete and then we can continue. Okay, so now we've got flowers, we've got a baby boy, baby girl, pregnancy, best man, reception, bridesmaid, groom, bride. So, so yeah, it, it's still all related to weddings and brides and grooms and, um, and, and what not you. So anyway, you can play around with this guys as long as you understand that one word is not going to always do it for you. In fact, if you're only going to put one word inside of here, guys, then you're going to get very bad results. So I'm going to give you an example again, guys. Another example one of the one of our users actually came back with was abs. I entered an acne treatment. I'm going to type that in here. 
I entered in acne treatment and I got LSI keywords and the results were nothing, you, you know, there were nothing related to what I wanted them to be related to. So let this complete and I'll show you exactly what that is. Okay, so we've got acne treatment and now we've got results like religion, recent posts, recent forum topics, women, lady style, health, diabetes treatment, you, you know, and then obviously you've got acne treatment just whacked in there somehow. So by looking at this, you're thinking, hang on, this is pulling back gibberish, you know, it's pulling back words that are none related whatsoever. But what we need to realize, guys, is, you know what, Google has related acne treatment with these words, but it might be very, very, very distant. Um, and for us to get precise and get that grouped theme set of words that we're looking for, then we need to be precise and tell Google that we want to be precise. So my reply to the user was, okay, you know what, add in one more word, add in the word spot, spots, sorry, and click on start. So I'm going to add in the word spots after acne treatment, click on start so that we can see exactly what kind of keywords we're going to get now and to see if we're getting the kind of um, semantically related keywords to these that we want. Okay, so now we've got things like acne scar treatment, acne skin care, acne treatments, acne myths, acne cures, baby acne skin, acne spots, acne treatment. But anyway, I'm sure you get the understanding of exactly what I'm trying to explain, guys. Um, when you actually want to use the LSI discovery script, then it's very important that we try our best to enter more than one word. Um, because if you're only entering the one word, it's going to be very, very broad. Um, and being very broad, as you saw from acne treatment, we've got words such as religion. Um, so try your best to give a combination of words. And I promise you guys, you're going to get down um, your exact LSI keywords that you need. Um, but obviously, we need to try our best to make sure that we're using combination words that Google are going to recognize as a set as well. So anyway, guys, this was a quick update. Um, obviously, we've updated the software and I wanted to get this video out to better explain the LSI discovery tab. And I really hope this will help you now. So thank you very much. And I hope you enjoying the tool.